Uh, three, three are complete and five is in work. Understand, two, three are complete and we're working on step five, thanks. That uh, call uh, live from the station from Commander Peggy Whitson confirming that the hatch to the Harmony module is now open. Uh, the crew uh, going through the procedures to uh, set up uh, their entry into that module, uh, having completed opening the hatch during the time that we were out of communications with the station. All of that to continue to go smoothly for them. The hatch uh, planned to remain open from this point on as the crew uh, continues their work in that module. The hatch uh, can remain open. Uh, flight controllers and engineers evaluating that today, uh, ensuring that uh, it is uh, not a problem for the crew to leave it open. Uh, the crew just having to take on a few additional responsibilities uh, due to systems that are not hooked up in the Harmony module yet, uh, that including a smoke detection, uh, caution and warning system, and uh, limited ventilation. This a view now from the station showing the interior of the Harmony module as a uh, Whitson and uh, flight engineer Dan Tani at work in the module. Again, having just opened the hatch, has a Harmony in service at its new home, its permanent home on the International Space Station. The station's currently 220 miles above the Indian Ocean, above the islands of Indonesia, as the crew begins their work inside that module. Alpha Houston, space to ground two. Once again, no response required, Peggy but, or Dan, but when you can, if you could open up the uh, IMV node two aft port valve, we'll uh, send some ventilation your way. That took call to uh, ask the crew to configure to allow the ground to turn on fans so that to uh, provide intermodule ventilation on the station or IMV. Also, uh, Tawny just taking out some... Uh, ...to the uh, note to aft port IMV valve to open. Is that correct? That is correct. Do that manually? That's affirmative. Tawny taking out some of the uh, okay, pads installed inside Harmony before it was closed up for its move and relocation uh, that uh, help control humidity inside the closed module. Okay, that's complete, Vegas. Uh, guess I'm looking at the lab forward port IMV valve, and I think it's still closed. Do you want me to change that uh, to open? Good thinking, Dan, but that's a negative. We'll go ahead and take care of that from down here. Okay, that's great. As we continue to receive live television from a camera that looks inside the hatch of the Harmony module. Uh, the crew uh, having just re-entered that module after its move and relocation today uh, to recap events of the day on board the station. All has gone uh, very smoothly for the crew as they completed uh, a move of uh, the largest uh, component yet to be done without a space shuttle present uh, by the station. The bus-sized Harmony module and its attached uh, mating adapter uh, moved this morning from its port that it had been uh, temporarily stowed or attached to on the Unity module, detached from there at 3.21 a.m. Central and reattached to the forward end of the Destiny Lab at 4.39 a.m. Central. Uh, bolts uh, driven to secure it in place at that location, its permanent home at 4.45 a.m. Central this morning. 
Then uh, at about uh, 10.52 a.m. Central Time, a confirmation uh, to the ground that the crew had opened the final hatch to gain access into Harmony at its new location. Uh, that uh, now the plan to leave that hatch open. All activities with that uh, going very smoothly for the crew as well. Ahead uh, for the station crew will be two more spacewalks to outfit Harmony. Uh, the first of those planned on November 20th, another November 24th by uh, Dan Tani and Peggy Whitson uh, to connect cooling and other uh, equipment on the exterior of the module and to prepare it for the arrival of the European Space Agency's Columbus Laboratory. For the crew uh, in the coming days of the week, we'll be uh, turning their attention uh, Strongly two preparations uh, for the first of those spacewalks. Uh, that first one again planned uh, less than a week from now on November 20th. Lab, where would you like those? Stand by. With the hatch open, the crew also able to do some work uh, inside Harmony. No preference, just let us know where they, where they pick. In preparation uh, for Thank you, we have no preference. its outfitting and arrival uh, of Columbus.